Uncle. What's up, guys? Hold on, let me do the intro. What's really good, fam? It is your boy, David Brand New, uh, uh, back with another video for you. Uh, and today, we got another banger video for you guys, all right? That is because the short folding stems are here, guys. Currently on my way to my dad's house right now, I gotta pick up my Espinesta. I ended up leaving it over there. That bike has one of these short folding stems on it already, and I'm working on the website, so I need to take a couple more pictures of it, especially with the stem like detached. It'll make sense. I know I'm speaking in code, but you'll see, you'll see. I just need to take more pictures of it for the website. I only got like three pictures up right now, but yeah, that's what I'm headed over there to do. Just realized I did that whole intro with the freaking AC blasting. Sorry guys, we'll get them next time. Here's the bike we're looking for. I don't know if you guys noticed from that last scene, but my folding stem is not a folding stem at all. <laughs> it's actually a quick, I can't even say it. <laughs> it's actually a quick release. <laughs> um, kind of like uh, like quick release front rims on bikes. Kind of like that, all right? There's a latch where you undo it and it will completely release your handlebars. Now, this design choice was on purpose because I personally feel like the folding stems are not safe. Like once you switch to BMX bars, you're gonna wanna ride your bike aggressively. So I wanted something a little bit more secure and I feel like this design nailed it, okay? So you don't have to worry about your handlebars collapsing if you hit a bump or anything. It's like almost zero chance that that can happen. Your boy is like low key changing the game. Like I don't know what the demand is for this stem because nothing like it is out right now. But just imagine if I release this joint and like demand calls for me to like reorder another like 500 stems, you know what I mean? Like what a time to be alive, right guys? I've been teasing it for I don't know how long. I've actually showed it before in previous videos, but you guys don't pay attention. It's all good. I've already showed the stem in like the last like probably four videos, <laughs> like very closely too. So if you guys don't know what my stem looks like, dude, you're super late, sorry. Quick update with the guy that had the broke down Yammy. The new battery didn't work on his bike. The bike still isn't working, but good thing is that he has a free battery now. So when his bike is working, he has two batteries. So that's dope. Um, I reached back out to Rattan slash Yammy and um, asked for them to send me a LCD screen. So it came today, he's gonna pick it up. I don't think he's gonna bring his bike again, but I'll keep you guys updated. I'm pretty sure that's gonna work. He thinks it's the, the cables, but I just don't think that's the issue. We'll see though. Back home, I know Prezi, I'm Obama, ay. I condone the drama, ay. I tell me I'm Madonna, ay. Do you need pajamas, yeah? Stay in the night, girl, you promised it. I hide in the cave like Osama did. I'm going and bag in the diamond district. What's up guys, brand new day. The guy that has the broke down Yami is coming over uh, to pick up his LCD screen. I'm about to go out there and give it to him real quick. He didn't bring his bike, unfortunately, but he said he's gonna try it when he gets home, so he'll give me an update on that. There you go, dog. What's up, what you got there? This, you've seen this before. No, I haven't, bro. Little tiny bike? I haven't. It's freaking, it's a slow bike. Electric too? Yeah. The good thing about all this is that you're gonna have like extra parts. So when we do figure it out, like you already got two batteries, you know what I mean? So once we do get oh, your yeah, bike yeah. working, yeah. you have like extra parts, you know? Yeah. All right, this is my little favorite tiny little bike. It's the Mac Wheel e 16. All right, it only has 250 watts, I believe, but this bike is so much fun. But today is a sad day because we're actually selling it. And guess who's buying it? My neighbor, George. Check out the old version of the folding stem though. Oh my God, we came a long freaking way, have we? This stem is like 
shit on a stick compared to my new one. I'm not gonna even lie. Like this one is trash. My new stem doesn't even have this top. Um, if you recall, we needed a shim for it to fit BMX bars. And that's the reason why we ditched this whole design pretty much. The cool thing about my stem too is you can use any BMX stem or mountain bike stem, like whatever stem you wanna use, you can use it. George wants me to switch out this short folding stem for this long one. Uh, so it's super simple. It's actually the same thing technically. This is just a taller version of it. Check it out. Plug and play. Boom, look at that. All right, so we need to unloosen this bolt right here and the quill stem should slide right out. Here's the quill stem, all right? This is what like the original Electric XP had, all right? But now more of the uh, e-bikes are coming with the threadless setup and they don't have quill stems. So, and that's the good thing about my new stem is that it doesn't have a quill stem as well. So you can use it on all the newer e-bikes. You can pretty much use it on any bike. That was freaking fast. Plug and play, all right? We just traded out the small stem for the long one. And I'm not gonna lie, I kind of missed the bike looking like this. It's actually not as bad as I thought. So next, what I wanna do, we're actually gonna take the electric light out for a off-road ride again. I know I'm supposed to change out the tires for some street tires, but I've been having a lot of fun with this bike. So we're gonna hit the trails and we're gonna test out these headphones and see if they stay on my head, all right? Let's go ahead and hit the road. Currently got the high Lou headphones on right now. We're gonna test out this sound quality. On the ride up, I'm not gonna lie, it's been working perfect, okay? I think these are a really good headphone to pair with your e-bike because you still wanna be able to hear the outside world. And because it's not sitting inside of your ear, you can do that. Forgot to wear pants today. Smart move, Dave. Do have the protective gear on though, so we should be okay. Oh yeah, oh yes. <laughs> Let's go. This is nice. Oh, no suspension. Here you go. Don't panic. Woo. There's gonna be this huge hill coming up and I already know this bike is not gonna make it up. But to be honest with you, the motor has been working great. Like I've been surprised. Like I almost feel like this is better than the electric XP 1.0. Even though the electric XP 1.0 can go 28 miles per hour, it's something about this bike that's just so much fun. I think it's because it's so lightweight and like zippy. Like it's gonna suck when I actually add like another motor or a bigger battery on it because it's gonna get heavy and that just takes away from the fun factor. I'm not gonna lie. So it's gonna be a different type of fun, I guess. Ooh, bumpy, 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 bumpy. Oh my gosh. Yes. Full throttle, by the way. Killing the bike. <laughs> Let's just walk it up, okay? <laughs> I'm not in a rush and I don't want this bike to die. Even though the bike has walk mode, even this one doesn't, <laughs> but uh, even though the bike has walk mode, I never use it. Like if I'm walking the bike up a hill, I'll just feather the throttle a little bit just to help me out. Like, I don't know, walk mode seemed cool when I first got introduced to e-bikes, but it's really just a gimmick for me. I don't know, let me know if you guys are actually using it out there because I'm not. <laughs> Look at this, oh yeah, oh yeah. Woo, yes, nice. Slow down now. Nice. Good. Good. Don't fall. Don't fall. Oh, 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 we made it. <laughs> I am out here breathing hard as hell, guys. <laughs> oh, I wish I had Leticia's power right now, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> this bike is struggling. All right, let's see how fast we can speed through this section right here. Oh, we don't have a full charge, but it's okay. Come on. Come on, Dave. Woo, yes. Oh, yeah. Nice. Oh, 24. Not bad. Dude, we only got two bars. Scary sight. Look at that roll runner. Look at that. It's a roll runner. Let's chase him. Let's see if we can chase him. See if this bike can keep up. Oh, he's fast. Okay, here we go. Huh. Boom. Can we hit this ramp? I don't think we're going fast enough. Oh my God, I'm scared. I'm actually scared, guys. What's going on with me? Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. I don't know. It's kind of scary. Let's go. Look at this bike moving so agilely. That's even a word. 
Oh my goodness. I love this bike on pavement. <laughs> I can only imagine when I switch the tires, it's gonna be amazing. Oh, that was sick. That was sick. Oh, let's go. Oh, it's Father's Day, by the way, guys. <laughs> I don't know if I told you guys. This is what I wanted to do on Father's Day. Hmm. This is like a little racetrack. Hmm. Come on, Dave. Woo. Let's go. We're tucked. We're tucked. I wish you could see me. Come on. Oh, oh, who wants to race? Who wants to race your boy Dave? Nobody. Wow, that was freaking amazing. <laughs> Sorry. I wanna try to see if I can hit 30 miles per hour on this bike. The only issue is, there's a set of police officers down there. I don't know if you guys can see them, but they're down there. I'm gonna be going 30 miles per hour on this bike. Hopefully I don't get a ticket. Whew. All right. We are going 23, throttle is no longer contributing. Let's see if we can hit 30. There's the police officers. There's our speed, 28 miles per hour. We're still within the legal limit. Now we're riding illegally past police officers, 30 miles per hour. What are we saying? Oh, 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 that was a wide turn, but I don't think we were affected by it. They didn't care. They're not even looking at us. All right, guys, that was freaking fun. Hopefully you guys had a lot of fun watching this video. I'll leave a link to the Hilu Sports headphones in the description down below if you guys wanna pick those up. They've been working great thus far. I think these are gonna be my go-to headphones for all my rides. Stay tuned, the stems are days away from being released, guys, literally. Okay, guys, we'll see you guys in the next video. And until the next one, deuces like that.